Oh, I see where, uh, yeah. It's, there's a flat, it looks like it's flat enough at the very peak to be able to plonk a condor on it. Shall I try and land and then uh, drop your rope? Hang on, I'm coming down, slowly. the other side aren't you? I'm sliding. That's not sliding. Oh shit. That's falling. Oh dear that does not look good. There is no fucking way you can land a condor on there. Where are you, man? <laughs> uh. Oh, fuck. <laughs> You're still falling, aren't you? <laughs> you Just... actually fell off. <laughs> well, I'm down. Did you survive? Uh. Yeah. 2% hull. Really had... <laughs> were, you, were you recording that? <laughs> yep. <laughs> this I have to see. I'm Get not, it up there, boy. I will st I'm not streaming, but I will send it up. Landing gear. Holy moly, that was a tumble. Okay, there's nothing on the very peak which is landable. <laughs> there's a metallic meteor right up here. Shall I go, <laughs> <laughs> shall I go and scoop it? <laughs> That's going to help you. Newman's just come online. Oh. Yes! I recognise this bit from earlier. I think I'm going to meet you on the way down. No, I'm at the top. How oh, are you? Well done. I'm in, yeah, I'm in my condo, you dork. Oh. <laughs> are we in the same instance? Yes, because yes, we're winged up. Of course wing. we are. Of course we are. Duh, numpty. Alright, let's see if I can get back to base. In one piece. Ah! There are seriously no, there is absolutely no way he could have landed a condor up here. And I don't see how you could have got up to the peak either. Well, I did. <laughs> Not right to the very top. I did. What, that spire? Yeah. <laughs> I've got, oh shit. Hang on. Oh, this is not good. Oh, this is not good. Hang on then. Am I back in time for someone breaking something? You are Almost actually. That. Almost oh. actually, yes. Ooh, right. 100% hull repair. 100% <laughs> hull boost. That's what I see. That's it. You, kiss, you try and kiss a planet there? I climbed up to the top. The top wasn't the top as we thought it was. It kept going. There was three other tops after that top. Are you at the top now? I did make no. it, yeah. 12 kilometres up. 
You gotta try and get down now. Yeah. <laughs> I'd say when I came today, someone got stuck. That said, I helped him on. He jumped onto my ship. I helped him down. He fell, I don't know how many kilometers. And he got. He didn't, you know, not a huge amount of damage when he hit the bottom. Just kind of parachuted. Didn't Good evening, up. Mr. Newman, sir. Hello, sir. Wait a minute, you're trying to tell me I've been to the supermarket, filled the car with petrol, picked the girlfriend up, yes. come back. And yes. Yes. Jesus. Yes. <laughs> Do you want me to go take a run over the, over the mountain? Oh, well, if down you... to where it's sort of flat. Yeah, I need to have if a... I stay, if, if I stay at this height, then I'll be at this, the same altitude as I was above the jump, mountains. If you jump off and press P, you get a parachute, I promise. Oh, do you? Oh, I'll try that. Top tip, Glen Park. You, Cheers, mate. And you also can't get pregnant the first time, either. <laughs> <laughs> well, as I was at work recently and someone was asking me Honest how, how my two girls right. were getting on. The short corner is like, I don't have any children. Can you guys hear me? Hello, Glen. Yes. Hello, okay. Newman. Hey. Now, uh, when I connected just a moment ago, you probably saw I went offline. Uh, I saw the icons flash, but I couldn't hear anything you guys were saying. Ah. So I just restarted Discord and that works. Yeah, when I was in my lunch break today, I was spe t t um, speaking to people in the game. There many people that don't seem to own mics in this day and age. I know I've had ship mics, but... Yeah, no, this wasn't it. This was a software glitch. Probably because it was a Skype call not that long ago. And How many other idiots followed you up the mountain, out of curiosity? No one. <laughs> I don't think I'm in the same instance as you. I'm going to go head back, try and get the ship. Okay, currently it's six kilometers. Sweet. So, how's the kamikaze expedition going? Really Good. kamikaze at the moment. I'm not a bit kamikaze, but I can't find my fucking ship. I don't know what it is. I've lost all sense. Try of recalling it. Idea where we are. Dude, where Seven we kilometers. Climbed Just climbed up to this really steep mountain. It was like Anybody a got, vertical and that's seriously steep. Wall. I hope you took some. Oh, you got the video of it, haven't you? Yeah. Have a look in distant stars. The the uh, pictures I took. I will do once I get to the bottom. No, I'm talking to. Uh, I human. will do. You can look I'll as well. Find my course. ship. You mean why aren't you coming on this? You got to come. Come on. At least eight yeah. million. It's only eight million. It's only around the corner. He'll be with us in the next half an hour. Yeah, random well, Hades, I recommend it. Yeah, random Hades, yeah. Oh, you need I'm gliding down this okay. mountain. It's you cool. You were at an altitude of seven and a half kilometers. Jesus, I've been going Above down for about plane. ten minutes. Is that like my cheap uh, Chinese phone that I went to the beach one day and it told me I was yes, 50 meters above sea level? Even though I was at the beach? I guess I'll, I'll take the next one. Distant star, distant worlds. Distant worlds, yep. Oh, is there gonna be another one? I thought this was kind of the next distance. Yeah, 3303. No, this is distant stars. Okay. Right, I'm uh, going off to my planet. Plus, I'm going off to my assigned system. It didn't sound very difficult, but we found it quite a challenge getting here. It was. Uh, oh, you gotta wait until I get back to the bottom, mate. Right? You might have done because you had like a haze of whiskey to fight your way through. Hi, Wake. Oh, well, that's cold heart. I was misinformed. I was told one of the tiny little stars was up, and I kept trying to go into it to scoop, and I turned out it wasn't scoop. Both. Anyway, did that twice, never again. Hopefully, by the time Distant Worlds comes, we can replay our hull and our engine. Because, how is it we it's can the power plant. these little you buggies? Can, thrusters you can repair. Yeah, but. Hull, we should be. Able, we can beat these buggies to death 
and just one click the repaired. We just need the auxiliary power unit, which keeps life support going. Well, you, you need... just get in your helmet, just like when you replace your windscreen. Cockpit doesn't turn life support off now when you when you um, repair it. Well, I, I did it a couple of days ago because I smashed the screen. Not much, but like a percent or two of the repair, and I could see the the screen of the mat. I was wearing a mask. But yeah, you good point. I didn't check to see if we had oxygen timer going down. But surely in these massive ships, can't we just go and sit in like a room that's sealed off with oxygen? No. I think it stops you from freezing to death. Also, the dying developers, for whatever reason, don't want you doing it. High wake. Look, look, it can't be anything worse than Ice Man than when um, Arnold Schwarzenegger did it. Come on. No one could be as bad as that. Oh, there's people still coming in. As I was about to say, we get. Oh! <laughs> 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 there's a fucking idiot up here. <laughs> Can't you refuel? <laughs> it was in my SRV, don't worry. I'm refueled now. <laughs> I, mean, I was just about to say, I'm trying to think how much refuel I can do. But our meeting point was an S, S type star. Absolutely massive. So you could just kind of free wheel, uh, free wheel it down the hill then, not the plan. Well, the good old days when we had bangers. I, I'm coming back down to base camp. And once I get to base camp, then I've completed it. Kill the fuel rats, good one. Kill the fuel rats, yeah. Or will they fuel hamsters for the SRV? Who knows? Ah! I think I think he's scratching her head going, how the fuck did that idiot No, I got all the way to the bottom and now I'm tumbling. What's going on here? I actually met someone new at this base camp today that I hadn't met before. But the view from the, the uh, cluster is pretty spectacular. You've got the whole of the galactic plane in view. Amazing. So how many ships turned up in the end? Or were you too busy trying to claim it? I've got nine above me at the moment. Oh, did everyone come watch? <laughs> I, I, I was too I busy think, not giving a shit. I was think like they're all going to line up and shoot me just as I get to the end. Was it like a big dogging <laughs> session, was it? Yeah. <laughs> Something like that, yeah. I was trying to explain that to my girlfriend. That. She didn't quite understand the concept of that. Well. Did, did any of the big works turn up tonight? Or have we been left on our own? No, they're turning up at four. They're doing the uh, oh. early morning one for the, the guys that... Helping you have a look in distant stars, Newman. Yeah, come in distant stars, Newman. That's Come on, you've got big ships. No, I was talking about the channel. Oh, uh... Like the Discord server, or...? Yeah, the text. Oh? Oh, yeah, on this server. I saw someone ship today and I'm sure they had a Sherpa badge. I don't think they were back, plus I didn't realise they got a badge. I felt envious. Sherpa? Um, pretty much what Distance Worlds was. Are you talking about it couldn't have been that no. It couldn't have been that good because I, I never heard of it. 
It went just before Christmas because I was going to go on it and then I thought, mm, too many it's things So happen. colliding with the Colonia Christmas delivery round and stuff. Oh, fuck that. Remlock Industries had an expedition that took off on Saturday as well. It's mostly yeah, mostly French. Aren't that the guys who make the life support <coughs> emergency mask? It's a big French team. Did they surrender halfway along? <laughs> no, no, they surrendered immediately upon departure. Actually, I watched an old Top Gear, and they were going on about um, the time Germany had that long holiday in France in 1942. <laughs> and kill myself. I haven't seen that episode yet. <laughs> I look forward to watching that later. No, sorry, it was the Top Gear one. You I've just said it was the Top added. Gear one. Yeah, sorry, he's thinking of um, Grand Tour, aren't you? France, France yeah. have some pretty distinguished <clears throat> military history, just not really. I oh, think, for uh, fuck's sake, okay. Napoleon took the one, whole bloody Europe over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One, one of the funniest ones was, um, well, why he was taking some of it over, the Brits were just beating the shit out of him in Spain and Portugal, so no, he didn't actually take over all but of you Europe. Know what? I will, I, and the Italians were against him, and he never managed to invade them. I would never actually call somebody a military genius if they invaded fucking Russia. Yeah, oh. I never understood that either. Right. When I become oh, this is this is turning rapidly historical and political. Not when I, I refuse to do that with leader, drunk people. I will be doing that. <laughs> Anyway, it's China we're going to be fighting. Come on, let's kill the fuckers. We're not going to be fighting, we're going to be clicking the keyboard. <laughs> we've got <laughs> we've got the best keyboard clicker in this class. <laughs> yeah. We've got tremendous keyboard clickers, the best clickers. <laughs> Even the sound scares people. How did he get on at university when he was in the library and the computers and stuff? Surely he got asked to leave. Who, hey, Kulitar? No, what's his name? The <laughs> on the keyboard. It's Kulitar, isn't it? Yeah, Kulitar, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's the point, actually. At my university, I read them a, well, not a few times, but sometimes I looked at them. Um, the entrance to our uni, I went to Stirling. Uh, not a bad uni. And they had uh, letters that uh, Napoleon sent when he was, I think it was his first time when he was on, um, what's that island that the British shoved them on? Was it Montserrat? Anyone remember? I think it was Montserrat, wasn't it? Oh shit. Oof. Carried away, then. There we go. Where am I going? My ship's fucked off, and I haven't dismissed it. Very cool. I can see you lot in the background. It just looks like you've got a bunch of ambulance crew around you with all these flashing lights. I'm under attack. It just looks like a car crash. <laughs> oh, please don't crash. Please don't crash. Please don't crash. Oh my god!
Ah. <laughs> he just <laughs> that was awesome. Oh, when I left, you'd found a uh, what you thought was like a human structure up there. Was there one? Hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh, fifty percent hull. Oh. It's fine, yes, I think. <laughs> I can make it, I can make it. Who renamed the channel? Uh, I don't have permission. Oh my word! There's a big old mountain system on there, much bigger than the one we just left. What, nearby? Yeah. M67T626-1B, the planet. <laughs> oh my That's lord. That's one of the things like, when we get allowed to say, uh, what's the big uh, mountain of Mars called again? Shit, I should know it. Mount Olympus. Oh, That's the one. Yeah. I'd like to go see it. Yeah, I wouldn't mind a visit myself. Except you can't land on Mars. No, it's Europa yeah. you're not allowed to go to. That's what it says in the book. You're not allowed to land on Mars because it's been terraformed, so it has an atmosphere. And it has an atmosphere oh, yeah. anyway. Oh, you mean in Elite? Uh, okay. No, I was talking about in real life, I'd like to go. But you can actually see. Oh, sorry, you're space going space in real life. <laughs> well, well done to you. I think you got more chance of doing it in Elite, mate. Yeah, true. Well, with Frontier, that might not be the case. You might have more chance in real life. No, no, no. It's coming. be pretty funny, like, if... In, I don't know, 20, 30 years, we actually land on Mars, and then when they interview one of the astronauts and they ask them how, how the 
you know, what inspired them to become these astronauts and how, <laughs> how their life led them there. They, they'd say, well, I used to play this game called Elite Dangerous and Frontier would never pull their their thumbs out, so I just decided to do it in real life because it's simpler. <laughs> Two years' time, we will have landable. I'll put money on it. Yeah. They, they've, yeah it's the same game engine from, from what we've got just now. It's the same game engine. Come on. Half the work's done for them. It's just server side problems. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. There's a lot of problems to overcome, and uh, there's a lot of detail that you need as well. Especially I assure you, likes. we will land on planets before they do in Star Six. I, I don't think you. it's gonna be in two years. I think it's gonna be in three or four. Oh. The, the, I will admit, I think we're six months behind time because they're putting a lot of effort into exactly. Um, and that's PS4. Not but that is good. Well, no, I think it's good for the game because it's more money. Oh, sure, but it's just... That's the mountain range I was talking about. Uh, we're already... They're already late, and the next expansion should have been out by now, by the original plan. And yeah, it's going to be this... at least six months late. But you must admit, I mean, I don't know about you, but I didn't know what this game was going to envisage. I think it's come a long way. No, yeah, definitely. I really I think we should have... Oh, wow, nice just pictures come being... Landable Earth likes are a big, big hurdle, and we they should... do have other plans before yeah. that, so it's not going to happen in two years. I, we, we, uh, two I hope years I'm wrong, happen. but I don't worry, I'll remind you. I just you. wanted to get the game game actually bug, relatively bug-free as far as these oh, game-changing no, shit happen. is concerned. And they need to completely re-fucking-do engineering because it's a fucking pain in the royal fucking arse. None of that's going to happen, you know that. Stupidly unimaginative way of, in, of uh, implementing it. Yeah. But then they do have that pattern. I mean, look at how they did ranking up with factions. Look at how that's they did. That's not random. No, not... they always said they were going to come back. Yeah, it, it is stupidly unimaginative, though. So. Yes, you know. I agree with you. It is stupidly unimaginative. But at least it's not fucking random. Yeah, I know. It's just so double you, you're RNG. You're guaranteed. <laughs> you're a gu you're guaranteed result at the end of it, aren't you? Yeah. You Whereas are. with our engineering, you're not guaranteed anything. Yeah, but I mean, it's real life. You take your car to the garage, you take your This is a game. If I want real fucking life, I won't play a fucking game, will I? Sorry, that was a really inane comment. <laughs> he's You're getting as bad as the other person that comes on. He's boys. got IBS today, lads. Give him some, give him some slack. <laughs> We're going to get it. Come on. <laughs> We're living we the dream. We are, just not that quick. We're more chance of having landable planets than we do of getting a new fucking hot ass. I'm gonna have to buy the hot ass X55. I've just resigned to it now. Well, that's what I'm using, and I'm still happy with it. So, oh, just as long as I'm you holding... get a powered USB, yeah. I'm holding out for something better. Yeah, use a USB three. Why is that? That's good to know. No, you need a powered there. USB hub. I, yeah, that's I... what I've got. Mine is plugged in an uh, unpowered one and it works just fine. You go Colin, do that. What? I'm, mine is powered in an, mine, mine is plugged in a non-powered USB pl uh, hub and it works just fine. I get the occasional glitching unfortunately. Yeah. Well I've got a powered USB hub, it just uh, helps me. The mountains on this aren't as, as spectacular. Helps for the, the old... Um, Memory sticks when I plug them in and out. But this X52 is falling to bits. X55, I think, is far superior to 52. Well, I'm not. I don't think there's a good reason to buy the X52 anymore. The X52 is. It's got like um, I can't think of the name for it, but it's. It's got old ports. You know, it's not USB or anything. It's just ancient. Yeah. But I'm still it's hoping. It's got the old that... game port. I'm just hoping, hoping, hoping. Get a picture of that. Logitech make it better. The Logitech aren't going to pull their finger out their arse until um, Star Citizen does something. I do like the Iridium Wing servers, uh, how they named the channel about Star Citizen. The channel name is Scam Citizen. Yep. Oh! Our uh, namesake got a mention in Lay Radio. 
Unfortunately, it wasn't us. Namesake. What, um, the candy coat? That. The... What's it, what do they call it again? The Colony, colony Defence Force up at Jack's? Colonia. Colonia. Yeah, they've they've all got these... Um, the, the clans are going out to to make things, and they've got um, representatives from all the clans. And one of them they named was the Candy Crew Guild. Oh. Yes, because the Candy Crew Guild have applied for one. So we we didn't get the mention. No, but the Candy Crew Guild applied for one, but they didn't use Candy Crew Guild, otherwise they'd have been shit. They yeah, they team up with other people, yeah. Yeah, because they're not the Candy Crew. Indeed. Uh... Get a picture of that. Should we go ask them? Get a picture of that. Well, oh, this mapping's a lock. Well, I'm off to main arsenic again. Have fun. Don't tell Dr. Cal I'm not. I'm not doing any exploration. Don't tell him. As long as you, you're not actually impel compelled to do anything. Well, you can't bring data back anyway, so who cares? It's just basically uh, making sure we got a catalogue of everything in this cluster as much as possible. That's why I'm taking three pictures of each, or three screenshots of each uh, system, of each object. One with all the info on it, one in um, debug cam, and uh, one of, of these um, system system map with the info pointed up. I want 150 arsenic before I go back. It's, it's possible. Why did you come out here if all you're going to do is fucking go, go looking for arsenic? <laughs> just, just a stupid question, perhaps. But... I'm not good at... I'm not, I just don't feel like exploring just now. <laughs> 